Only a monster would do such a thing. The Boltons will pay for this. After all we've been through, must the gods continue to shit on this house? What have we ever done to them? Follow the Starks? Obey the rule of law? Ramsay Snow is a bloody savage. He shames the entire North. Yet we're bound by law to obey him. Can't believe it's fucking come to this! The Glenmore Guard are gone. Ordered home by Ramsay. So much for having allies. Ramsay says he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be yours, Royland. You'll get no argument from me. But how do we bloody fight them? We just don't have the numbers. Not yet, anyway. And they still have Ryan. Right now, everything depends on Asher. Once he and Malcolm bring us more fighting men, then Where we... is he? Where is my brother? My lady. My lady. Let me through! Elena. Roderick, tell me where he... Oh! No. No. Oh, no. No, Arthur, no! Arthur! It's my fault. I brought him into this. I asked him to help. He did this for me. You can't blame yourself, Lena. He was a grown man. He made his own choices. But he trusted me. He always has. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. <laughs> he was so nervous, the father called him Quiver. <laughs> and now to die, like this, tortured, mutilated. I wish there was something I could say to make this easier. Is that meant to console me? Ramsay came here because of you. If we hadn't been your allies... Elena... I'm sorry. Oh, God. Oh, Let's get you someplace warm. How do I do this, Roderick? How do I keep going? Where do I find the strength? Know that we'll have our justice someday. Justice won't bring my brother back. You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. Right from the very beginning. I should try to get some sleep. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I don't know what else to do. You're not alone, Elena. I'm here for you, whatever you need. Thank you, Roderick.
There you are. I haven't seen you since the coronation feast. How many ships do you suppose it takes to move an army? Ships? Why in the world would you... Never mind. Mira, I'll be honest. I took an enormous risk, defying Marjorie to get you into that feast. And you thank me by making a scene with Lord Andros, in front of everybody. Marjorie saw, of course, and she knew exactly how you got there. I'm sorry about that. I, I really did try to be discreet. But you couldn't, could you? Because you're in over your head. I know it. And Marjorie knows it. Which is why it's not safe for me to be around you anymore. What? Mira, you're not the girl I knew at Highgarden. She'd never be so reckless. And now that Garibald and I are discussing marriage, I just can't risk being associated with you. Not anymore. You know how much I need this marriage. I won't do anything to jeopardize it. Sarah, you can't mean this. I have too few friends in King's Landing as it is. I'm sorry. I really am. But I just can't anymore. Was it worth it, at least? Sacrificing so much for your family. They're still in very grave danger, I'm afraid. Well, I know you'll do everything in your power to protect them. Well, thank you for your help. They'll be very grateful. I better go before she sees me. She already You're a forester. Can I help you? You need to come with me. Now. Why would I? Don't make this difficult. <laughs> 